Yes, I'm back with uh, more Empire Total War, playing Bavaria. Um, in the previous episode we won a battle against uh, Dutch rebels, so we are continuing the occupation of uh, Holland, which is indeed our most important province. We have some Westphalian rebels here, they have had some success against the Hanoverians, who took away the Rhineland for us. No one has touched uh, mainland uh, uh, or the homeland Bavaria yet. We have been left in peace there. We are also at war with France and that is really worrying. He is um, allied with Spain and he's building some armies in there. I can't see behind the flags the uh, little regiment uh, count us there but uh, he's building an army uh, uh, I don't know really what to do I would like to go for Hanover itself but um, as it is I don't have enough troops and these are pretty much low strength again so yeah these are full I think I think they're full mm, I don't know but these are our best regiments, especially this cavalry regiment. Mm. So when we make an offensive I might want to go for Hanover itself, but that means I would like to protect Amsterdam uh, in a believable way. I think he has most of his army in here actually. Let's check. Um, oh, he has a lot of uh, rebel sentiment there. He has the same problems as we do in Amsterdam actually. What's our... our uh, I think it's going down but we might actually have a rebell rebellion again. Mm. I couldn't get the army back in because the rebellion was uh, somewhere out here and I couldn't, couldn't get the army back in to suppress those rebels. Do we have any money? A bit yeah, and his regiments are really crappy though. These are only militia and uh, gendarmerie. There's a regiment of horse, but uh, nothing much. I'm wondering if he has left his uh, <coughs> capital. Uh, nah, he has another army in there. So he's much stronger than we are actually here. Diplomatically. I would like to make an alliance with uh, jolly old England there, um, but uh, everything I've done diplomatically has failed. The uh, um, diplomacy is really, really stubborn. Um, and I, I, I was trying to go for the military text so I could actually trade them with uh, Austria and other friendly neighbors but that hasn't worked either uh, Austria won't trade with us even and they're our best friend so mm, no nah. cannot ally with an ally of your enemy okay who is that oh yeah Hanover of course okay and can I actually trade anything with you? Well, we have nothing to trade with you, do we? So, seems like he has it all. <sighs> unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Austria, why won't you trade tech with me? They are very friendly and they are our only friend and we are their only friend, so uh, they should they should do this if uh, this worked in a logical way. Now we only have the plug bayonet to uh, trade with them. I'd like this. Empiricism. Yeah, I'd like this and you get the plug bayonet. No. They won't. Um, really unfortunate. Um, so I'm 
actually thinking about completely giving up on diplomacy in this game because it's not it's not working working out uh, properly mm, and really in this game you have you never have any true friends that's why it's called total war so uh, what else to do this turn we can't move in there nope and um, we could repair some stuff or recruit more regiments I don't know if that will help at this point repairing these things um, wouldn't be a priority no <coughs> uh, how's our army in here looking well they are low strength aren't they and replenishing them would cost all our state treasury um, so we're going to do that and uh, go to the next turn yeah we're really in in a deep spot here actually okay next turn yeah here we go our research into ring bayonet has been completed um, and we have detected a, a, I'm guessing a Hanoverian agent. Workers on strike, yay! As usual. In the uh, end turn, the Hanoverians marched out of the city and um, attacked the rebels. They defeated them, finally. Um, I'm guessing this army is down on strength now. We could march in, but. Uh, we still have the French to um, be thinking about there. <coughs> I could beat that army though, no problem. And then he'd send in reinforcements from there. Um, yeah, that's something to think about. What I need to do first is to change the research. I will need to do these things myself. Now, I was actually hoping to trade them with. Uh, the other nations but that's obviously not going to happen so I need to do them myself we have one gentleman in this school mm -hmm. would be nice to have that going as well though we need to repair it that will cost 650 we're going to do that and uh, get that research going there as well now let's see, we have 540 left, can we recruit some... Uh, isn't that fixed yet? Repair cost 230, I'm going to repair that as well. I thought that was repaired actually. Now I can't recruit any, but uh, we'll get some more regiments soon enough. I could march on those now. <coughs> um, take them out that's what I'm going to do just for fun yeah this is going to be a good battle okay see you on the battlefield okay here we are it's a winter landscape <coughs> and uh, in, he'll be coming from there we are going to set up our guns actually I think they are standing pretty pretty well where they stand no we are going to set them up here I think um, it would be fun to have him come this way and just run into a line of uh, infantry and uh, our guns just uh, just on top of this small hill yeah this army is really under strength I'm wondering now if this offensive is a, was a good idea uh, not a longer line This is how I'm going to set it up now. Um, I want these militias 
on the flanks. I'll probably leave them behind and defend the guns or something. I don't like the militia. This is our best cover regiment. The best regiment in our army. Ah, let's just go see wha what happens. There is. I think he wants us to come for him. Um. Yeah, well, he's coming through the uh, forest in it. Uh, he's sending his general's bodyguard out. A good thing to see though, that our guns are responding. Let's just... Uh, what has happened there? Have you shot your own guys or something? need to get down that hill. I think they've shot their own. Look at that. Isn't that the general's bodyguard? No, it's a regiment of horse. Let's get our boys up here. Yeah, this is very unfortunate. They died to friendly fire, I think. Uh, really unfortunate. Yeah, our guns are working on those, at least. Now they're fleeing. That's good to see. Maybe I could send these guys. Oh. Yeah, that's good. That was a good result. Bit of revenge for the friendly fire incident. Yeah, I'll let him go now. The rest of his army is coming up here and uh, this is not looking good. Yeah, run into our musket fire here. Run into a musket fire. Don't want to lose this regiment, but it needs to fight. They have only lost one man so far in this. Here comes more. My boys can hold. Run. Yeah, he's a, he has a lot of cavalry actually. Let's get these guys back now. Because that's. That's not leading to anything. <coughs> fire. Just fire. Let's get reformed. Yeah, all the action is on that flank now, but he's coming in with some guys here as well. Can I get these guys to just cover that area now? Run. They were tied up in... Uh, oh, we killed the enemy general. That's nice. Let's get closer. Although I hate the militia, they have really proven themselves. You know, all my fighting here. Okay, that's it, I think. Go chase them down. We lost a couple of men there, but he lost more, I think. Uh, I think this is the end of the uh, enemy army here. Not that this was a very good victory, because um, st strategically, I think we're not supposed to be here right now, in this area. Uh, actually, my guns can now stop firing, please. Uh, you're chasing down the enemy, I hope. Uh, 
I'm not going to use the general and I'm going to end the battle right here so okay okay that was supposedly a heroic victory um, we lost 43 men that's a pretty good result again uh, he lost 202 so uh, yeah just one regiment or something left there um, he will be coming in with more there and that battle will actually be a lot more exciting but we are going to march on the Rhineland here now we're just going to demand surrender and it worked again so we are back in the Rhineland but I don't think this situation is actually to our advantage because uh, now we are bo <laughs> bordering France he can march in whenever he wants and also Hanover so I don't think I don't think this was a very good decision okay Lothar von Tungen uh, okay patriotic sword he has been awarded some sort of he's a confident general yeah he is mm. yeah the French will be marching in now uh, so this was strategically this was a bad decision and this guy still has one regiment left we have no money to repair this 380 we have 310 everything is against us in this game actually um, this is not enough to defeat the French so and we will have rebellions so this was pretty much a wrong decision very much a wrong decision in fact um, unless Hanover uh, would uh, go for peace nope of course not what if I give you my 310 and uh, Nah, they feel insulted. Um, really, really unfortunate. There's just no way getting this going, I think. Um, and when the French come in with this army, um, that's going to be probably the end of my army there there are no fortifications either so I can't just sit and defend behind the walls or something but there are uh, uh, yeah he has line regiments and uh, Cheval Le, Le Cher and all, all sorts of good stuff Regiment Etrangère is that how it's pronounced? Militia, yeah, he has a good army. Mm, we don't. So, yes, but we are going to, anyways, go into the next turn. I think we've done everything we can here. Mm, that's not us, this is us now. Mm. Sweden. I could uh, make a trade route to Sweden for some reason now, all of a sudden. I uh, will request an alliance and a trade agreement. No, he doesn't like that. How about just a trade agreement? Nope, not that either. Uh, they are really stubborn. Okay, he went at least he went for a trade agreement. J 
Genoa, <coughs> New Spain, Persia. I'd like to trade with the Mughal and the Marathas. Yeah. But I, the fact is our trade routes will be raided by the French and uh, they will get richer. We will get poorer. Ah, oh, that's what we can do now. <coughs> okay, it's just time for the next turn now, I think. So, yeah. Okay, back we are and we survived. Uh, our mm, Netherlands is in uh, writing again uh, and the Rhineland is in writing. So, yeah, pretty bad. Uh, the French army here hasn't moved. That's good. But he's still building these troops and uh, a French fleet sailed into here so we are not going to get any anything from our trade routes. We are going to send one militia regiment out there to oust the uh, throw out the French ships at least. Um, he will probably uh, be attacking me very soon. Again I'm going to leave the Rhineland. I'm not, I don't know why I went in there again. <coughs> a bad spot to be in. So oh, I haven't checked my government in a long time. We don't need need a naval minister now, but these guys are really really good. You, the head of state. Um Maybe we could find a better head of state. Plus one to management. Huh. Minus one to happiness, lower classes, and he gets minus. Oh, and he gets. Uh, that's. I think I'm going to install him instead. Honest and harsh. So he. This guy's better. I'm going to make him head of state just for the sake of it. He's better than the previous one. Policies. We are exempting those two regions from taxes. Uh, we have this Hanoverian regiment trying to get home th over there. We're going to send someone out to kill it. Uh, what is it a cavalry? Yeah, it's a cavalry unit. Mm. I'm going to leave the Rhineland actually. At least we have caused the Hanoverians some damage by taking it back. Or actually, are we getting anything from it? Everything's burning in here still. Everything is burning. Repairing it all is costly. At least now I have Amsterdam repaired. I want this school to be repaired too, but I can't afford that. And now I can't afford to recruit any regiments. Nope. Ah, what a, si what a situation. What a situation. I need to get my army out of here, at least. I'm not going to leave anyone in here uh, to hell with the Rhineland, actually. But we have caused the Hanoverians some damage. We're going to take that out on our way home. So let's go that way. We're just going to auto resolve this. No point in fighting that. And we lost 38 men. Oh god. Yeah, that's why you shouldn't be auto resolving ever, really. Can we get back into Amsterdam now? Nope. We are back where we started actually, but uh, at least we have uh, the Rhineland. I can't def it's uh, completely impossible to defend it and I, I, I really want to um, hold Holland. I'm never going to leave Holland, not without a really bloody fight, but uh, the Rhineland is impossible to defend so I'm just going to leave it uh, and hope that 
uh, the Hanoverians come in with more troops and take it over again so that they uh, divide their armies that's the best thing I can hope for and uh, yeah the French might come in too yeah nothing much to be done here again let's see now we are friends with Spain though and with Austria of course and with the Italian states who are you Lombardy Lombardia yeah. um, <coughs> basic steam pump I think we have some metal working buildings if we get this you get you get carbines how about that no rejected as usual I'm not going to bother with that I'd really like to be allied to Sweden though everyone's refusing everything so not, nothing more to be done we are going to go for the next turn and see if we survive and what happens to the Rhineland here okay and we're back uh, we have a rebellion again in the Netherlands and a rebellion in the Rhineland um, actually that would be the neither France nor Hanover has uh, done anything about the Rhineland so the best result would actually be if the rebels just took over this place and recreated Westphalia actually that that would be the best possible result um, what else yeah nothing much happened during the uh, the end turn so really we are still alive and kicking here we are going to get our army in here now and uh, refuel if we can uh, now that's really low this time around really really low mm. now that will cost me 900 799 yeah, I, can't, I can't even refuel all my regiments here let's do these ones um, they are the best I have and yeah rebels again in here and no end to the unhappiness I think I might be marching out for them again um, we'll see because this episode has come to an end and uh, well so yeah see you in the next one and cheers